right, this is Clayton again, and I wanted to do this video for a couple of reasons. Um, I've been using my Motorola S9 um, Bluetooth stereo headset, and I've been having actually some problems. But before I get to that, I want to show you this cool product I got. Because it's, um, it's nice and light, and um, you know, it fits well, um, you don't really want to put this in your bag, and it's going to get smashed. And I, I've seen, already seen videos on YouTube uh, of people breaking theirs and you know I spent like 50 bucks for this but you probably spent like 130, 140 bucks for it and you want to protect your investment. So I, I found like a low cost um, way to protect your investment. I got this um, bag, it's a, it's a neoprene bag and, um, and you put your headset in here. It fits right in here. So actually, I, I usually put it um, uh, the heavy part going down with the end of earbuds up. Put it in your bag, zip it up, and there you go. And actually, this this bag is really cool because it comes with this hook. And what I do is I hook this to my bag, so it's you know dangling off my bag. So you know the, the, you don't have to put this in your bag where it'll get smashed. So it just be hanging off your bag, or you can just carry it like this, you know. So. Um, so this is, I got this off of eBay. Um, just search uh, Motorola S9 bag and this is what you get. It's 15 bucks on eBay. The guy who sells it also throws in another set of earbuds. So you can't have too many earbuds, can you? So, so that's a cool deal. So I like this. And actually, if anybody knows where I can, where I can get a hard case bag for this it'd be kind of cool if um, someone had a hard case with um, styrofoam molded to fit the headset that'd be awesome to have because then you can put it in your bag and it definitely won't get smashed so if anybody knows who sells that or where I can get that you know write a comment okay or leave me a note um, okay now back to um, some problems that I've been having my problems have been related just to the iPhone so if you have an iPhone 3G or 3GS um, you might have problems with the Motorola and I'm not sure why it's you know why there's problems with these two products but there is sometimes when you're listening to the music it stutters the music stutters or the music slows down or it just kind of cuts off for a little while and then it goes back so there's obviously some kind of uh, range problems with the iPhone and the Motorola headset and I've searched the internet and I I haven't found any other phone that has that problem with this headset. This headset has other problems, but not this problem. <laughs> but um, so um, I searched and I searched, so I, I, I kind of found the culprit. And evidently, it seems that the GPS um, radio in, in the iPhone is somehow interfering with uh, the A2DP uh, uh, stereo Bluetooth for whatever reason. Um, when I'm using my headset, I put it in my pocket and it already stutters. You know, the music stutters, it go, you know, and sometimes it even slows down, which is kind of bad. Um, so I notice I have to keep uh, my, um, my iPhone very close to the headset. And in fact, I'll show you um, what I've been doing because um, I want to use GPS with my iPhone when I go walking but I also want to use my Bluetooth headset while I'm walking so the G for me the GPS counts you know how, how long I've been walking and how fast I've been walking and keeps track of all that uh, I want to use all that so this is what I've been doing okay so this so here's the bag that I use and I have one of these um, I, I bought this a while ago one of these uh, cases um, and I use my agent 18 case and and then um, I can put it in this in this uh, leather clip case, which goes onto my um, onto my bag um, <clears throat> strap, okay. And I notice if if I mount it right about here, okay, then I get perfect reception with my Bluetooth headset. So that's what I've been doing, you know, just you know mounting it on here with my bag, and I've been getting good reception. However. I know most of you want, don't want to do this. I'll do it because I only use it for walking, but um, if you use it on an everyday basis, you don't really want to do this. So Apple needs to fix a couple of these things with stereo Bluetooth. One, 
these range problems I'm having with GPS. I turn off my GPS and it's, it's been fine, but once I turn it on, then I gotta do my little workaround with putting it right on my shoulder. Two, Apple needs to implement the full AVRPC file profile, which will let us use um, track forward and track back. And that, that, that'd be so perfect for the S9. Um, so that's the, the th that's the things I've been having. I've been also having off and on problems in my car. I'm trying to stream Bluetooth music or any kind of Bluetooth sound through my car. So, and sometimes my car recognizes it and sometimes it doesn't. But I, I can do, for some reason, I can, I, I can always do hands-free hands -free calling. That's been no problem. But sometimes the Bluetooth music that works or d doesn't work or doesn't get connected. So there's some problems there too. So Apple needs to fix that. So just a bit of a warning. If you want to get the Motorola S9 Bluetooth headset, you might want to wait a little bit. If you're an iPhone 3G or 3GS user, um, it's not perfect. It's far from perfect. Um, for my, luckily I got this for 50 bucks and I, did, I found my little workaround. Um, so again, um, if you're having problems with your S9 headphone, you might want to turn off 3G. I've also heard people um, turning off Wi-Fi and maybe even 3G, and that might help things too. So, But I found turning off 3G works, but I still want to use my GPS apps. So, okay, so hopefully Apple, um, hopefully it'll come in 3.1, and the 3.1 beta is out there. So I haven't heard anything, but hopefully the fix is coming soon. So uh, I'll keep you up to date as to what I'm finding out about Bluetooth and um, the iPhone OS. So I'll keep you updated. So um, thanks for watching.